Welcome to the Stage 10 Review. In Stage 10, we met the first and second person plural of the present tense of regular verbs and the irregular verb to be. We met the first and second person plural personal pronouns in the nominative, and we met the comparative degree of adjectives. So by the end of Stage 10, you should know the new endings for the first and second person plural of the present tense of regular verbs. You should know the endings for the first and second person plural of the present tense of the irregular verb to be. You should know the new personal pronouns, nos and wos. And you should be able to fill out the following charts for regular verbs and the irregular verb to be. So let's take a look at the charts. First, the personal pronouns, just the nominative. First person singular, ego, I. Two, you singular, nos, we, and wos, you plural. Okay, those are the personal pronouns. They show you what person a verb is. But of course, what really shows us what person a verb is, is the personal ending. So the personal endings for regular verbs in the present are o, s, t, mus, tis, n, t. We have the whole chart. First person singular o, second person singular s, third person singular t, first person plural mus, second person plural tis, third person plural nt. So I carry, you carry, he or she or it carries, we carry, y'all carry, they carry. For the irregular verb to be, we have to learn special forms. Sum, I am, s, you are, est, he, she, or it is, sumus, we are, estis, y'all are, sunt, they are. At the end of this stage, you should also recognize comparative object, adjectives by the or ending of the nominative singular or the or before the ending in the stem in all the other cases. And you should know to translate comparative adjectives blanker or more blank. So degrees of adjectives. The positive degree is just the regular degree of the adjective. For example, lightus, happy. The comparative degree, lightior, there's that O-R ending in the nominative singular, happier or more happy. And finally, the superlative degree that we've been seeing for a while has this isse, isse right there um, before the ending. So lightissimus, happiest or very happy. So positive, comparative, superlative. And as always, you should know all the words in the vocab checklist from Latin to English and from English to Latin. Remember, we have the Quizlet lists to help you with that.